Hello, this is Ian McFarlane. This short tutorial is going to walk you through following your classmates' blogs. When you log into your WordPress account, it takes you by default to your reader. Your reader is where you will see recent posts uh, from any blogs that you follow. Um, right now, as you can see, my uh, reader is empty. I'm not following anyone with this account. Um, but it will be nice for you as students to uh, follow your classmates so that when they write new material, uh, it will show up here in your reader and you can browse through and read what your classmates wrote and choose one to comment on. Alternatively, you can uh, just follow my blog uh, as I will be syndicating uh, all your classmates' posts, um, but I want you to have uh, both options. So uh, if you look at the, the reader screen here, uh, WordPress will give you some suggestions about who you might want to follow um, or just have you kind of explore around. But we want to make sure we're following our specific classmates. So I'm going to show you an example using a couple of uh, blogs from a previous semester. So I'm going to flip over to um, another student's blog from a previous semester. Um, and you can see here uh, he's got his post. Uh, if you scroll down, you can see you know a whole bunch of other posts. Um, but down here in the right corner, there's this button that says follow. Now, simple as that, you just click follow, and it will tell you that it will now show up in your reader. Um, I'll also go over and follow another blog from a previous semester. Um, so now I have two blogs that I'm following. So if I go back, and now in my reader, uh, if I refresh this page, now normally what you'd see here is a list of recent posts. Because these are from previous semesters, they haven't been posted on recently. Uh, but if I go here to this Manage button, I can see that I am indeed uh, following two, two blogs. Uh, if I ever change my mind, if at the end of the semester you don't want to follow your classmates anymore, uh, you can just come over here and click this. Um, and you are no longer following that blog. Okay, if you notice when you come down here, you can also uh, stop following from the blog itself, where it says following. If I click that again, um, I'm now unfollowing. Following, unfollowing. Okay, uh, just for to have this, if you uh, click here, you can turn on that you want to get an email whenever there's new posts, and you can set up a uh, a frequency of emails. You can set up that you want to get emails if there are comments on it. Um, you're free to do that if you like. Uh, if you want to get the post the instant that they're posted, you should probably do an email. Um, but it'll show up on your reader uh, pretty soon thereafter as well. Now, to follow my site, it's going to be a little bit different. Uh, my site also makes use of WordPress, but mine is on the hosted version. So uh, you have to do it a little bit differently to follow me. Now if you go over to my blog here you'll see uh, there's a follow us with these different buttons so if you want to follow um, on Facebook or Twitter um, you can follow my social media and I will post uh, when I put up new prompts and things like that on there. Uh, RSS if you have an RSS feeder you like um, but if you scroll down a little bit, uh, you get this email updates. And so you can put in your email address here, and every day you'll get a summary of everything that's posted. And I'm going to, like I said before, syndicate your classmates' blogs, so their blog posts will show up here as well. Okay, so there's two different options. Now, if you just follow my blog, you're going to miss out on the, your classmates who set their blogs to private. The only way you can view the private blogs is to actually go to the blog and follow it uh, just like we did here. Okay, I will post a list of the links to everyone's blogs on Moodle as well as on my course blog and uh, that way you can find and make sure you're getting updates from all your classmates. Well, I hope you enjoy your blogging assignments and I hope you're as excited as I am to see what your classmates and you will be posting.